This is the longest freaking makeup receipt I've ever had. <laughs> a full face of the OG matte cosmetics and this bag is so freaking full and heavy guys check it out this is gonna be so fun so I've always wanted to do this a full face of Mac okay let's start with skin prep a majority of this stuff from Mac I haven't tried okay first up hyper real serumizer just a hydrating skin serum mmm smells really nice that feels really good on the skin now this is interesting it's a skin canvas bomb Looks like a rich cream. These smell so good. These feel fucking amazing. Okay, we have the skincare. Now I'm going to use the Studio Radiance Primer. This is like right up my alley. Moisturizing, illuminating, and silky. Oh, she's thick. Oh, wow. That's giving glass skin. Okay, the three of those combined, first of all, feel fucking amazing on my skin. Second of all, made my skin look so healthy and beautiful. Now I'm just hoping makeup goes on top of this like epic. Okay, we're gonna move on to the makeup. I bought my first ever MAC brushes. I can't believe I always wanted these as a child. This is like full circle fucking moment for me. It's really cool. Let's open these up. They are so beautiful. There's so many different kinds. The foundation, the MAC Pro Longwear Nourishing Waterproof. Got the two lightest shades. That's NW20 and this is NW15. I'm gonna do this one. And you best believe I'm using my MAC brush. Wow. I do like the shade selection. Also, this brush works really well. This is so beautiful. I love how this is sitting on my skin. It's so radiant and skin-like. And yeah, my skin feels, like, nourished. Okay, this packaging is really cool, and it has, like, texture. This is the Radiant Skin Bronzer. I got two very beautiful shades. I'm just using this to warm up my face. I'm a bronzer girly through and through. Okay, I'm excited to try the concealer. This is the Studio Fix Smoothen Concealer. I'm going to use the shade NW15. Anywhere I want to lift and highlight. It has a really creamy formula. It seems to be more buildable medium coverage. I'm just smoothing it with a sponge. And I want to see if it's buildable. Because I like a more full coverage. Oh, it's building all right. That looks nice. All right, now I'm going to set with the MAC Studio Fix Pro Set and Blur. I am very picky with loose setting powders, especially because most are just too dark for me. This is the lightest shade. I'm definitely very terrified looking at the color. Yeah, it, it's very yellow and too dark for my under eyes. See how it kind of took that brightness away? See how yellow... I mean, it's smooth. It is very smooth, but shit, that made my under eyes look yellow. I'm going to use it to set the whole face just to balance out the yellow. <laughs> we were doing good up until that point. Go to part two.